hello and kind of welcome back to the Talos Principle. So if you weren't aware, my GPU died in my previous PC and I got a new one pretty quick, a new entire PC. There was no point just buying a GPU for an eight-year-old PC. So I got a new PC and things were looking fine. It's very good, almost too good, like I had to pay more than I really wanted to, but everything that was worse than this just had like massive issues and red flags and just things that seemed to not even like function basically. So I have a PC, it works fine. I've been testing it in certain games, streaming a little bit, playing some stuff on my own and on that front, it's working very well. But setting everything up is, is a nightmare and I don't want to drone on for too long about this, but I'll just say that I'm not entirely sure if I'm actually back when you see this or not, or when I record is when you even will see it, because as you have seen at this point, I had one video already recorded for Talos Principle and one video already recorded for Rain World before this whole crash, so I could edit and get those done and they seem to look and sound about the same as before, but this is the first time I'm recording on the new PC and I'm a bit worried. I keep doing tests and things are just... I don't know, there's just something weird. I feel like it's a bit laggy in the recording, even though my, my game is running flawlessly smooth. It's, it's great, it's amazing. I can basically turn up everything in the game to ultra, except for super sampling anti-alias, which is ridiculous. Like, without that on, I get over 200 FPS with pretty much everything maxed out. Then I turn that on to two and it drops it to like 140. And then I drop it to, or I raise it to four, four times super sampling. And then I have like 80 FPS or something. Don't really need that. I don't even know as much of a difference. So hopefully that should mean a decent quality increase. But the videos are still gonna look shit. I'm still on 1080p. I was thinking I would be on 1440p by now because obviously my GPU can now handle it and recording at that shouldn't be a problem. But I'm still on like ancient software, editing software. So I'm on like the same program, same version that I initially started my very first LP on. So this is like a, a fucking decade old antiquated program and it just can't handle like 1440p renders and stuff like that. So I would need to, you know, step up to a newer version or switch over to like Premiere or use some other free alternative or something. And if I'm gonna do that, then I need even more time off. So I'm, I'm just, I kind of want to continue Talos Principle in Rain World. I'm just gonna hope that it works fine, but it really looks like it'll be the same shitty quality, like when moving and all that stuff. These textures look really like grainy and pixelated and artifacting in the video, specifically because of uh, YouTube compression and stuff. And apparently if you do 1440p, that, that wouldn't happen, so... It's just very frustrating. I have this much better PC, but the videos are still gonna look as bad or possibly even worse than before. But hopefully we at least have videos and they sound okay and stuff. It On that front, it seems about the same. I'm sure I could get better audio if I really wanted to, but I don't know how to go about doing that. But anyway, sorry for the long intro. I, I'm gonna just do like one test recording here. I've already done tests and I don't know, there's issues. There's definitely still issues. So again, I'm not sure I'm back in full quite yet, but I'm gonna try my best. So hope you can be patient with me and maybe expect some dips in the schedule here and there. But for today, instead of like going all the way back to uh, the previous level and trying to figure out the, uh, the stars, I'm just, I'm not quite up for that right now. So I figure we'll just walk around this sea hub and kind of just sightsee a little bit and see if we can find any cool Easter eggs or anything like that. And that's probably going to have to basically be it for today. Oh, nice. Already starting. Kind of. Not really. And this level does seem very cool. I mean, you can still see the draw distance a little bit there, I suppose. But it should be a lot better than before. With, like, nature and things like that. Nothing in the terminal. Yeah, I guess we'll just focus on looking up here on the bridge to begin with. 
surely there must be something here. Like, at least a QR code, yeah. Figured. I'm also probably gonna keep this one a bit short, so... We'll see how far we get. Athena 10. Athena looked upon the imprisoned titans, moved by their plight. What crimes deserved such punishment, and how did they, in their confinement, avoid the pit of madness? Also kind of relevant to what's going on here. Ah, good old QR code scanning and cross-checking. It checks out. We gotta do it. Haven't had to open that in a, a while, my QR scanner app. So we have a level here. And two levels over there. I'm kind of surprised there's like nothing much here. To see or find. We have very, very open level. It's kind of interesting. I wonder if you can like jump in into a level somehow. You can't do that, right? Like from up here. I don't think you can jump that far, but maybe one of them. No, there's no way you can jump that far. I mean, it's not too far off, I guess. Maybe if we find some like neat spot. You can do some of that. This definitely feels like the type of level that would be breakable in many different ways, but we'll see. So there's another level this way. Are you telling me to just like wade across to get over here? Man, this is going to be a hard level to find like secrets in. There could be tiny secrets and pickups and hidden things anywhere. There's so many, like, pieces of rubble and broken down things and corners that things can be hidden behind. Especially when it's this open. See, so even if I wanted to, I don't think we'll have time to do anything other than just look around today. Let's just confirm all around all of the levels. Sometimes there are QR codes and stuff on these walls. Like so. Bunch of hexadecimal. Alright, here we go. Nothing lasts forever but the certainty of change. Very wise. D lyrics. It's like it's a song of some kind. And let's just go along here. Not sure if there's going to be more like background noise and stuff. This computer is relatively silent, but when things happen, like when I'm playing this game and it's very... Like a lot of things are going on. I hear my fans just like blaring at full blast. Little tree here. Though I don't think like background noise has ever really been the main problem with my sound. Mostly it's just like how sensitive my mic is and picking up like everything from mouse clicks to like keyboard presses and mouth clicks, things like that, which is very annoying. I guess we can't go on here. Oh no, we can go up, just not this direction. Yeah, okay. So this is about as far as we can go. What about up here? Oh, this is something. There's no way this is not something. Th this is nothing? Really? It seemed like such a, a distinct path. Oh, maybe up here. Come on, there has to be something hidden somewhere. I mean, maybe this is just going back up to the bridge, I guess. So that might not be anything that's supposed to be, like, hard to find. Well, not really. Hmm. Can I jump up here, I wonder? Oh? Oh my god, bunny hopping? Bunny hopping? Bunny hopping? No? Damn, that was like working really... 
really well for a second. Come on. Oh, I'm like, I'm almost getting up there. Hmm. Maybe not. That would have been fun. Yeah, now we're just all the way back down again. But there's a path up here as well. So now we're on the other side, yeah. So this also goes up. Yeah, there could be stuff just on these, like, little cliff outcroppings and stuff. That's gonna be very hard to find. Seemingly can't get up here. Yeah, this is too sheer. Wait. I guess we can't go this way. Yeah, too bad. Yeah, once again, I think this is it. Let's drop down, I guess. And this is about as far as you can go here. Oh, down we go. Did not actually want to go all the way down, but I suppose this is fine. Could be something all the way out here. Wait. No, I thought that was like something. I thought it was like a lambda symbol, Half-Life. Or something for a second? No. Yeah, no idea. Looks like nothing. But maybe here? In the, like, central... channel? Oh? This is definitely something. Well, it's it's a dragon statue. We've seen these in like many secret locations. I wonder, like, if are they just visual little Easter eggs? Just hey, look, you found a dragon statue. Or I wonder if we can some somehow do something with them. Because yeah, there was one in the uh, the underwater, not underwater, the uh, the water garden, as well. So for some reason, the dragon statues seem like relevant and significant in some way. But I don't know what they mean. Also, I might try for the next episode to just record using my uh, GPU to encode instead of the CPU. In case that means anything for anyone. I tested this out and I felt... Oh, this is interesting. We can just jump in here. I felt like using my CPU actually did look better overall than GPU, but now I'm seeing like kind of frame drops and stuff. Here we go. When recording CPU, not for me, but like I saw it in the, the recorded file. So I don't know if I like my CPU should be a lot better than my previous one. So I don't know why it would wouldn't be able to record at the same capacity, but who knows? A man cannot ignore the inevitable end of his existence, but we must ask, does the nature of goodness change simply because each life is finite? Stratton Oblivion Fragment? Nothing weird there. Yeah, I wonder what's gonna happen with this star right here. I guess it doesn't have to be, like, straight on. It could be from within one of the levels you... Activate a fan and it sends you like at an angle and then oh hello And then perfectly Makes you land on top of the star would make sense as well Yeah, just so much debris and stuff in this level Debris and rocks and uneven terrain Broken down structures all of that
I swear that glitch effect looks different now. I don't know if that was affected by some of the quality settings that I've now turned up. I feel like it looks different than I remember it. But I don't know. Yeah, there really is a lot to see here, just looking around. So we certainly won't be getting into the levels today. And let's check on this side. This almost looks like a head, like on his side, eye here, like cheekbone, chin, lips, nose, sort of. This might be something, that, that might be intentional, I don't know. Kind of reminds me of, once again, the Swapper, but we've already had the Swapper reference. Maybe there's more? Oh. Yeah, that effect definitely looks different. I don't know if that's noticeable on in the video or not, but I don't remember it looking like that. Oh, here we go. Message in a bottle. There we go. It was all worth it. Ooh. Aha. So, where is it broken exactly? There's like trees and stuff. Oh, this is interesting. Are we gonna, like, dig? Dig at the X mark? I should have gone... Ah, oh, hold on. Let's see if we can find this before I end it off today. I assume I can't go to that island. So where is it broken? I'm not entirely sure where it's... Like, which side? If it's over here, or if it's here, on this side? Could be right here. But this is all broken down. So maybe it's opposite? And then it would be, like, down here, I guess. Not quite. Let's try on this side. Does it look more aligned over here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think this might be it. Maybe? Hold on, let's try and get up this way. I'm expecting to see, like, a dig prompt, if we actually find it. I guess it's not here. Well, I guess I might not have time for this today. Again, I, I really should keep this short. I always say, like, oh, I'm gonna keep this short, and then I end up doing, like, 27 minutes anyway. But I really should keep this one short, because I don't know how... This is gonna exactly work out with editing and uploading and all of that rendering issues. Ah, oh, man. Yeah, it's kind of hard to tell, like, where it exactly means, which side. And if this, if this map is even, like, one-to-one, -one, or if this is broken down more since the map was made, or whatever. So... I think I'm gonna leave it here for today, and then I guess next time we'll have to find this message again and go on a little treasure hunt. So, hopefully this all works. Hopefully it sounds and looks about the same, even though it definitely doesn't look as good as I was hoping it would on this new PC. Again, I guess down the line you can expect another, like, vacation where I try to actually pick out and learn a new type of editing software, something that is a bit more relevant. But if I can get this working at least as good as it was, then 
I might just settle for that for the rest of this series. So, we'll see. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I hope you will see this. Goodbye.